early morning this morning. Uh, not feeling, not feeling too bad. Uh, a little better than yesterday, so that's good. Um, just prep for a meeting, got some reading in, and now I'm off to a, a quick meeting. Um, but it's awesome. It's like six o'clock in the morning, and uh, it's so bright out. It's really good because a, a lot of people I've been talking to this week, they say their numbers have been down. And we have, we have a call to action ready for, for this weekend. Just finished a uh, bike ride, did a couple phone calls, caught up on some messages and emails while I did it. Um, anyway, one thing I wanted to chat with you guys about, I've been getting a lot of comments about this idleness thing that I posted a couple days ago. So just elaborate a little bit. When I say idleness, People have said, like, well, Jason, don't you come home on a long Friday after a long week and watch a baseball game on TV or watch a movie or just kind of, like, veg out and do nothing? And the answer is yes, I do that every once in a while. But I think for me, the details are in the purpose and the context of why I do it. If I'm resting because I need to recover because I had a super long week or something stressful is going on or whatever, then even that, I don't call that idleness because I'm still recovering. It's still for a purpose. So I still have... A meaning behind why I'm doing it so I guess for me that's the distinction I think the context is key if you're sitting on the couch doing nothing because you just are doing nothing then yeah that's idleness and that's very bad if you're sitting on the couch watching a movie because you've had a crazy long week and you need time to mentally and physically recover that's for a purpose that's different I do not consider that idleness so it might be a little detail you guys might not agree but that's that's my context of when I think it's okay versus not okay. It's 21 degrees outside. I have 15 minutes before I have to leave for my next meeting. Quick project. my new office for the summer. Not a bad backdrop for the next meeting I'm about to have. Uh, pretty good, all right. Oh, one quick thing. Uh, usually I have my cheat night. I love peanut butter, mini peanut butter cups. Usually I have my cheat night Friday night or Saturday night, but where I've been semi-sick, I haven't been able to get into the gym this week, so I'm gonna say it here. I'm gonna try to get through the whole weekend without having a cheat night just because I don't feel like I've earned it. Um, Anyway, I'm going to rely on you guys to hold me accountable to that. So, no cheat night today or tomorrow. Okay, Friday night after supper, I'm on my way to uh, baseball to coach some kids, teach them how to hit. Second last Friday night for this. Uh, this is going to be the end of the vlog. i got to go back after uh, the session at 9 o'clock tonight. I do have just a tiny little bit of work i got to catch up on before bed. And then tomorrow I'm off to uh, Amherst for a men's basketball tournament. We're going to see how that goes, see if I can still play four or five games in a day. Uh, anyway, so tomorrow's vlog should be interesting. So this will be it for tonight. I'm going to wrap it here and uh, do baseball and then getting ready for tomorrow. So I'll see you guys on the courts tomorrow.